if you could put Christian's performance against the Rams into context as his mother, how, how would you describe him throwing, catching and running in a touchdown on Sunday? Hmm. That was last Sunday, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was in the spa. I like got my nails done and stuff, so I didn't see it. Well, then show me your nails then. Oh. Lincoln Park in the dark, baby. Worth it. <laughs> Worth it. Need I say more? Now that was a performance. Getting these baby puppies on my nails. Are you kidding me? I don't know what he did, but look at my nails. Are you kidding me? So uh, did you read about it? Have you been? Have you had a chance? I, yeah, to somebody sent me. It? I was like, wait, what? Yeah. No way. They won. That's so cool. Oh my gosh. No, obviously we watched the game and it was, it was magnificent. I, it was so good. Actually, I just, I cry, I laughed. I cried. I, everything, the whole gauntlet of emotions. Um, we, I was, it was such an amazing way to watch the game too. Cause we opted not to go cause he's, it was in LA and I was, so this year I've made a pact with myself. I'm not making myself go to the away games. I'm like, he doesn't need me there. Um, he's supported. He's got his Olivia's there. Tons of friends were there. So I'm like, we don't have to go to that. And we had just got off the plane from Luke's game and Ed and I rushed home. So it was just Ed and I in our house by ourselves. And it was, I can't even tell you, we've been through so much, so many losing seasons, seasons and games and heartbreaking. And it was just such a turnaround. I, I can't even tell you, it was just so blissful and joyous. And it was so great because we were together and we could be just happy and be, and be our real emotions could come out. We were, we were able to like, you know, be just be happy and, and sincerely happy. And it was, it was just, I don't even know the word to describe it, but that was sheer bliss. Cause there's been a lot of non sheer bliss games. Yeah. It <laughs> makes you that, appreciate so those moments. It does. Now, right. It absolutely does. You got to go through the, through fire to get through to heaven. And mm -hmm. I just saw that in that game. So, I mean, you know, you know, nobody knows what the future will hold, but man, that was just, I, I just, we savored it. And we, we were just, I, I did, I cried. I can't help it. I'm such a dork. I'm no, so proud. So no, was, I, I felt me. like I was going to cry and I, you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm watching it and I'm going, the first one, when he threw the touchdown, cause I wasn't in yeah. the room, but Chris is coming. He's like, you got to come see this <laughs> Christian. Christian just threw a touchdown. I was like, like a short, pass. he was like, no, he like literally, it was a good it. one too. Okay. So, and then I remember right when that happened, I remembered I had talked to Peggy earlier in the week and we were just discussing where we're going to watch a game where she is and everything. And, um, she, out of the blue during our conversation, she goes, Hey, by the way, can Christian throw? And I'm like, oh, yeah, I mean, he's thrown before. I don't know if he's QB one by any means, but I mean, he's thrown a few, a couple in high school and I think in college. And then, oh, and then I remembered a couple of years ago, he did throw one to a tight end. That was a really nice throw. And I'm like, oh yeah, so I guess so. And that was it. Out of sight, out of mind. Didn't even think about it. And then all of a sudden that conversation popped in my head right when that happened. I'm like, oh my gosh. So Peggy and I are basically, what I'm trying to tell you is we're running the team. We are the ones who made That's... the trade happen. We called the play. I mean, Kyle, who? Seriously, Christian, who? We're running the team. I did not know <laughs> that Peggy called you and said, can Christian throw? And then maybe she, but, oh my God. Yeah, that good. was not the, the most important part of our conversation, but it, it, in passing, she actually remembered, oh yeah, by the way. Mm, yeah, <laughs> just randomly, funny. as I'm working on the call sheet for this week, I just <laughs> right, was wondering right. if you can <laughs> throw. And ball. then we talked about some goal line stances and what to do <laughs> and whatnot. But anyway, so yeah, they executed <laughs> it pretty well, according to our game Tell I loved her red zone game plan. Yeah, for sure. Oh my God, Lisa, oh, so it was amazing. It was so and fun, so. I just, again, I, yeah. having, knowing the journey and <laughs> all of the, the great moments, but the really hard moments that led up to this one, it was, it must've been cathartic. And I think it's awesome that you and Ed were able to be together, like on the couch, just going yeah. nuts and enjoying it. Not because sometimes we'll, we'll, get so angry we're in separate rooms <laughs> but this time we were sitting there together and just enjoying it so it was oh and ed ed does not celebrate until the extra point is kicked mm -hmm. he goes i've watched it too many football games where there's you know a challenge and it would whatever or not so he does not and i know that about him and it used to infuriate me i'm like how are you not happy on that play that touchdown and he's like not until the extra point is kicked <laughs> so he's funny about that so well i'm glad you got uh, to celebrate three times and and yeah more and, and, and all of them george kittle had a great great catch oh too. So to seal the deal that I, I, as much as I loved all of Christian's touchdowns, that one just sealed the deal. So then it was like, all of a sudden it was like oh, a little bit, you could breathe really out. Cause you, yeah. Cause it's so, one thing to have a performance like that, but if you don't win the game, it exactly. And that's what happen. starts going through your head. You're yeah. like, yeah, and you got, I got to get rid of those thoughts and just no, it was, shine it was the light awesome. on them. You deserve all the light. And oh, you're it nice. Was, no. I'm just so excited for Christian. <laughs> turns fun. out he has uh, learned the playbook pretty quickly in his limited time there. Peggy. And I, I can attest that he, has had his nose in the grindstone. He yeah. has been studying 
so hard. Normally I talk to him a lot and, you know, we just talk about things that are going on and it was minimal conversation that week. He's like, okay, I gotta go. I gotta go study. And so, and I'm like, dude, you need to go, go have a dinner, go just take a break here and there. So, but he was, yeah, he was nose to the grindstone. So yeah, he's okay. excited. Where were you? Oh, you were at your house, right? I was in at San my Fran. house. Yeah. You were in yeah. San Fran. How cool. I was in San Francisco. Yeah. I could hear my neighbors going nuts. I mean, the number of texts <laughs> that I get now when Christian is playing is, is really amazing. So did you call him after the game? Like, tell me about that first phone call. Yeah, I just, I, first, I always text him. I text him before the game and after the game always. Um, and, um, no, but then, um, I was like, you have to call it. Honestly, I think he was a little bit stunned more than anything. I think, you know, he normally he's like real chatty and assessing like, gosh, I can do this better. I can do that better. And, um, no, he, I think he was just like a little bit overwhelmed like with it. I could just tell in his voice, he has a mom, you just know yeah. that he's just trying to soak it in and be like, wow, that, that was, I know he, he was proud of himself and he's just assessing, I could tell. And so the next day when we talked, it was a little more, he could, you know, breathe a little bit and he was by himself and he, he was, he was excited. He just, he's like, just so excited about this team. It's like so fun. There's so many weapons and they're getting Debo back. And oh my gosh. And, and I just said, I'm like, oh, that was so cute. You're the number 69 guy, like picked you up and hugged you. I was like, you have friends and they're not bullying you. <laughs> I'm so proud. I don't think he got bullied this week. Yay. You know, the new kid in town. Like. <laughs> I think, yeah, I think whatever rookie hazing, I think it's probably passed at this point uh, if you score those, those yeah. kinds of touchdowns. Uh, all right. Well, congrats to Thanks. Christian and the Niners. And now that we've got a full bye week, I can't wait to see what Peggy has in store the rest For of the, the way. I know. Playbook. I, I mean, it's I just know. the sky's yeah. the limit. We have to have our weekly conversation on what to do. So yeah, there's some things we need to clean up. For the most part, we were happy with a victory. <laughs>